everybody. I have decided to pull out five of my books that I have yet to read but have been really wanting to read. And I decided since we are all quarantined and this is the month of April, I'm going to pull out five books that I'm going to read by the end of the month. And I'm going to give a quick video on each of them and the summary of them. For now, I'm going to show off the books I plan on reading. Right. So, the first one is The Clockworker 3. Um, I got this many, many years ago when I was in elementary. And I bought it because it sounded interesting and cool. And yes, I have yet to read it. But, you know what? I figured that this is going to be the perfect time to start reading it. And it's apparently like these three kids and somehow they end up together. And there's like a wish from last time I remember it years ago. I'm not sure about all the details, but uh, this is definitely one of the ones I'm going to read. The next one is... This one, The Killer Angels, uh, is about two guys, and this is a story based off of reality. It takes place in Gettysburg. I was at a gun show, and I was looking for Gettysburg Burks, and a older guy told me I could have this one for free as long as I read it. I figured that this is going to be my first book I want to start reading. And I actually did start reading it earlier today, and so far it has been fantastic. I want to read more of it tonight. I want to see if I can uh, even get to sleep, because it's pretty hard to put down. I found this at an antique store, and it seems to be part two of the Killer Angel, since it's the movie and special to the winning classic the killer angels though the last filler messenger so i'm going to uh read this one after that one so this is going to be my first my second book i'm going to get to pretty excited about it as well the next one i bought this quite a few months ago i haven't yet gotten to it so i figured now will be the perfect time to get to this one as well the speed to trust, trust, yeah, trust. The one thing that changes everything, uh, Steve Arconicky. I have read other books by him. I read The Seven Habits and The Eighth Habits. I have this one I really want to read by him as well. And I also have another one by him somewhere along with the bookshelf that I will probably get to next month, but this one I'm definitely working on. And last but not least, the four hour work week. I did start this one earlier and then I kind of forgot about it and I can't remember too much. Although, he talks about how to get um, work off your schedule and to give it to somebody else so you can do more important work. Uh, and how he manages to make a lot of money by working only a few days out of the week. And that's all I remember. That's why I'm going to put it to my list of things to tackle for this month and like I said after I read them I'm going to give a brief summary about them as well and so yes these are all of my books one more quick overhaul So I can't wait to get to reading them. I'm definitely going to start tonight. And um, if you like more of these videos, hit the like button. Leave a comment. And happy reading. Continue reading.